Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Starforge. Okay, so what's going on today? Well, today I figure we are going to do some exploration. We need to find some garrison ore because when we go into our inventory here and whenever you restart the game for whatever reason it doesn't give you your helmet we also need to create a pair of these boot or these pants which we'll do right now since we have the materials which is awesome bang now we have better pants let's zoom out a bit let's kind of oh let's uh it's a different control scheme here for this one uh is it c uh c okay uh why my, my pants are not different they're they look the same uh, or are these ones thicker? Let's put these ones on. Oh, okay, okay. So they do kind of look different, but they're pretty much the same pants. So obviously we are going to wear the bigger, thicker guys. Because that's just the way it's going to be. And we need to do some more exploration. So let's do that. So we are going to run in this direction. Now the garrison ore I found is in this area somewhere. Oh yeah, I was going to show you uh, why we need to find garrison ore. So if we scroll down to here, I want to build this space copter so we need more monolithium ingots. We're a lot short, basically. We need 450, so we need basically, what, 400 ingots more? Um, or is this 61 or 81? I think it's 61. So for, what, 450 ingots total, right? Well, if you go into here, you'll notice monolithium ingot, right? But you need to create the monolithium ore, which means you need garrison ore, which means we need at least 400 units. So I need to stock up on that. And then we'll need to find titanium ore. I can't remember if I did find that, uh, or can we create titanium ore? I think we can create it out of what, iron and and oil maybe I think that's what titanium is let's take a quick peek here steel dark sulfur antimatter no I think titanium ore we can actually mine this so we'll have to yeah we're gonna have to go on a little exploration run since we know where home base is that is not a big deal I did stock up on supplies up top there you can tell you can see up here we got the 29 healing we have 44 food and so I think we should be able to survive a little bit I was going to hit the crashed ship again but I don't think that is a very good idea and let's actually kind of make our way over to this thing right here I wonder if there's anything inside of this one I can't remember if I hit this one I hit two other ones I hit that one over there and one over there and so yeah, so now I'm just kind of making my way. It'd be nice to have a vehicle, but that Jeep, I don't know, I just can't find that Jeep. So either it, it entered into the world because I parked it on the outside. So it's doing something similar to what Seven Days to Die is doing with the, the mini bike, right? And now if we open this up here, yeah, there's nothing in here. And I get a bunch of lag, which is awesome. <laughs> Yeah, this game is funny that way. You know, I wish they could optimize it. I, I just it has so much potential. It had so much potential, and I was kind of excited for this one. But of course, what happens is the developers abandon the project, and yeah, and then move on from there. So it's just interesting. Interesting to see that. So let's see here. How can I make this episode interesting? I don't think I can. I don't think I will be able to. All I know is I need to find some garrison ore, and I need some time to play the game. I need to upload some videos, so I figure, you know, couple this with the fact that the wife and kids are, are out of the house. And so, yeah, so I, I, I am free to create this stuff. So let's pick up a bunch of sulfur here, because I think we used up a bunch of it. If we pull up... I wish there was a way of sorting this, kind of... Oh, never mind, you can actually... Oh, okay, you can actually hide pieces. Okay, that's so cool. I didn't know you could click on these. Right on. So we can hide the stuff we don't need. And then, then we can see in here at a quick glance. So I definitely need to find some titanium ore as well. But yeah, we were looking for... Oh, but it doesn't stay that way. Oh. 
We have 384 sulfur. I just want to make sure we have enough sulfur for building more ammo. Oh, now we're going the wrong direction. Okay, so which direction am I heading? I want to head towards the south. I guess we'll randomly go in a direction and hopefully I'll find some garrison ore. I, I thought I found it in this area, but for the life of me, no matter how much I explore this area, I just can't seem to find it. So I either lucked out somehow or somehow I went off the beaten path and just randomly found this one deposit. So so yeah, so as soon as there's something interesting, I will have you all return. Okay, perfect. So something interesting is happening. I found a titan uh, ti blah, 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 blah. titanium deposit. So I completely filled up on that. And I do have some nav markers. So let's actually put those there. So I'm going to place a nav marker when we find some garrison ore. So I've been traveling in a southern direction. So kind of in this direction. And when I saw that deposit, I had to go for it. So now we're kind of traveling down this way. And it's nighttime. There's creatures everywhere. Like that bug that we just saw. There's that weird crawly thing over to the left. Not really worth our time. Yeah, maybe for recipes, but I don't know. I find it a waste of bullets. So what's over here? Uh, looks like a Saltex. I wonder what that one is. Is that one a garrison ore? I don't know. That could be a Saltex as well. Saltex ore, which I'm not sure what that's used for, but I can't remember. Yeah, that looks the same as those two. What's back here? That's what? Voltronic ore? This is some more titanium right here. Come on, I feel like I'm close to it. Where is it? I remember kind of running across this kind of stuff before. And let's see, let's kind of run in this direction maybe. I don't know, I can't see. Let's see if there's any more ores past this. On this side over here. Uh, what's that down there? I don't think that's it. So let's go this way then towards this thing. This might be an iron thing. Which then maybe t to the left here, there's some gar uh, there might be some garrison ore. I'm not sure. But we're basically stuck in the game until we find some of that garrison ore, which then opens up into the monolithium and stuff like that. Right. So this is kind of why we're doing this. We basically have to do this. Find a deposit of garrison ore. You know, harvest up enough for all f 500 units. Carry it all the way back to you. Place an app marker. Carry it all the way back to our base, and then hopefully process. Base is getting further, and further away, but that's okay. It should still show up on our compass. I just, I, we just need those deposits, right? So, I'm gonna continue running around here. If I come across something interesting, you know, you'll be, be right back, basically. Yeah, and here we are. We are coming upon you know this kind of area, this whole forest area here. That's interesting. It's kind of like an alien forest biome. It just looks like there's some resources in there. It looks like some crystals. Too bad there's not like some kind of garrison ore or something like that. I wonder if there's different creatures that spawn in this biome as well. But you can't see anything through it. It's almost better to fly over it. And at night is when it really shines, right? Because all this stuff glows. And so it's just really neat to see when it glows. So let's switch back to our driller. So yeah, I haven't found the garrison ore. I imagine it was more in that direction. So I might head back, but... I need to find that garrison ore, because otherwise we're done with the game, basically. I can do more building, I can do more of that stuff, but I don't know. I don't feel creative with that in this game, for whatever reason. The, the box seems perfectly fine, and yeah. But no garrison, hey? And I didn't go this far out last time. I did find it, and I found it in this sloped area. But, for some reason, I just can't find it. I'm going to have to head back then. 
Okay, well, I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to head in that direction, maybe see what we come up with over there. Other than that, I look forward to you coming back for your eyeballs, so watching this again, and your ears, you know, hearing what I say. <laughs> I, I appreciate you all for, for watching me. If you've watched all, you know, all of this content so far, which I doubt very many would have, but that's okay. Because this is my entertainment, so I keep saying that to myself because, well, it's the truth. You know, I like playing these games, and I figure just playing them by myself is a waste of time. At least you're recording, you know, we're doing something productive, so you whether or not anyone actually sees. So, yeah, so thank you everybody for watching, and I look forward to seeing you all in the next one. Bye bye.